Hey witches, welcome back to the channel. It's the Wild Witch here. I hope that you are doing wonderful. So I know this video is super late. This is my spring altar tour video, but I figured, you know, it's better late than never. And I just filmed my, um, my other altar video. So make sure you check that out if you're interested. It's the one that I have for Beltane with the We Folk or the Fair Folk. Um, I'm doing something special for them. So I've got that set up. So I thought before I start my um, ritual work for tonight, I figured I better go ahead and record this video before it gets, uh, my altar gets even messier than what it is. So, as you can see, I've already had some stuff going um, up here, but there's still some candles and things that I've not um, done yet. So, anyway, let's just go ahead and get started. I'll go ahead and show you. It is crazy tonight. There's so many orbs that's flying around. Um, yeah, it's good. So, anyway, okay, let's get started. Okay, so over here, I've got my little egg um, candle, my little bird, and there's some crystals all along there. Now this is a little offering of blueberries, um, blood oranges, and this is a sugar orange slice. So anyway, and you know, because of the time right now, I did not have the stuff to make, um, you know, some food offerings. So like sweets and that kind of thing. I just I just didn't have it except for, you know, fruits and that kind of stuff. So I got my husband on his way in from work to stop and get these things. Let's see there. Chocolate cupcakes. Creamfield. Anyway, so I'm going to give that as well. But, yeah, so I've got all these little crystals back here. That green thing right back there with moss on it, that is an egg like a egg covered with moss okay here I've got these little flowers with this bunny and a little heart these flowers are actually soap so that's really cool and then this little dish of crystals and then there's some more crystals acorn that's a mushroom a dried mushroom right there on top of my Hackstone, and then I've got more crystals back there, some flowers. Um, here's some flowers that I picked here. That's honeysuckle, and the little yellow ones, is that's acacia. And then here's some of my basil. Um, back there are these little um, natural mints um, that I give. They're, they're really amazing. One's violet and one's lemon. Anyway, they're cool. Anyway, those are all just like little crystals back there, those four, and then that's my um, protection oil. And then this was, a, um, this was a little spell that I did for the earth and like for the people of earth so for, to help the earth raise um, the vibration to a higher frequency and, you know, for vitality and healing. Um, and peace and comfort to people as we go through, you know, this time. So I've been working it every day um, for the month of April. And so then I've got this soap right here so I can get it um, blessed to use, you know, for like ritual soap or whatever. And then back here, this is my ritual cup. And then the ritual cup for my goddess and you can see this drink it is absolutely gorgeous and it's natural I said this in the last video too it's all natural and it's so good it's just fruit berries um, herbs and I make a rose water you know to go in with it and then just water and then some little brandy um, to go in with it so just a little splash. So, and then that's just like a little painting back there of um, a tree, like with a full moon, a little bird. And it's like, you know, the grass is like just spring, you know, spring is just sprung. So the grass is just shooting up. Anyway, it's cool. And then I've got, um, you know, some crystals right here. 
So this is a, a blood orange, um, just the peel of a blood orange that I just um, peeled for offerings tonight. But anyway, you can turn this into a candle and you can use this part of the orange as the wick. And so I'm going to make it um, tonight, you know, and have it blessed and I'll use it um, in my practice and stuff. So yeah, that's cool. And then I've got these dried oranges right here. That I like to do oranges and lemons like this. And I even like to cut them in half and dry them. And then I'll use use them for spells. So like, um, just say for a lemon that I'll do, I might use it for a shut your mouth spell. And then put um, the picture of the person and um, petition or anything like that. You know, any anything that belongs to them, hair, you know, whatever you can put inside of the the peel because it's going to be, you know, like this, but it's going to be hard. So it's like a little cup. And then you can put your herbs, you know, oils or whatever it is that you want to use on top and then put a candle on the very top and then it'll, when it melts down, it'll seal the inside of it and then you can bury it, you know, or whatever you want to do with it. So this is one of the, the candles that I made to use um, for Beltane. So I'll, I'm going to use that tonight. And then, you know, this is my moon goddess water there. And then this is a um, incense wand. So it doesn't have any wood, you know, like the stick part. And it's just, it's thick. It's a lot bigger. And it's, I just make them and call them incense wands. Anyway, and then my little um, owl, and then I've got my key and healing rune, my little fox that y'all have seen a hundred thousand times, my little shaker skull, my crystal skull, my other skull, my little bunny, um, my petrified wood, and y'all see my little feather back there that fell. Let's see, is there anything else up here? I don't think so. I think that's pretty much it that I have. So yeah, I'm going to work this um, again tonight for Beltane um, for the earth. And again, you know, people, I'm going to finish it tonight. It's going to be the last night of it. I'm going to finish it. And then I've got some things that I have to do outside. I have a um, butterfly and bee little garden that I work with the uh, we folk out there as well so I've got I'm going to do a few little things for it and I'm going to make some um, an herbal infusion water that I, I give to the plants and trees and stuff as an offering so I've got to just go put that out there and then this altar over here uh, over here is ow, you know the same so this is I have inside of here is like you know for the offering for my ancestors and then on the other side over there I've got an offering set up for um, my spirits so I have each little thing set up different okay guys so that's it that's my um, spring slash Beltane will set up um, for 2020. I hope that you enjoyed uh, my spring altar even though it was so late and we're like at the midway point between you know spring equinox and summer solstice so I guess you'll get to see my summer solstice um, altar next. Let's hope that I can actually get it on time and we are not late. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Why don't you comment down below and let me know what you're doing for um, Beltane, if you're doing anything at all. Oh, I forgot to show y'all this um, little, it, this is actually a card back here, right here, that my mom made me, but I use it every year for spring. Isn't it the cutest? anyway all right guys i hope that you have a great night until next time i hope that you fly high witches i love you guys dearly peace home